you. There he is, but if somebody can be an IFN, WGNI, HD, as per always, and from our dating and relationship files. John, I share with you, as per always, and from our dating and relationship files, if you're under 40 years old and looking for love or you know somebody who is, experts say do this one thing recycle because according to a new survey half of millennials and gen zers won't date somebody who doesn't recycle the survey polled over 1300 single adults under the age of 40 a whopping 47 percent wouldn't want to be romantically involved with somebody who didn't recycle 45 percent of those surveyed think people who recycle and make an effort to reduce their waste are smarter as well and the poll reflects what a scientific study has now discovered According to the Journal of Social Psychology, men and women who are eco-friendly are considered more attractive as romantic partners and more physically appealing. The theory is that if somebody cares about the environment, they probably want to protect it for themselves, others, and future generations, like their future kids and grandkids. Looking for love? Start recycling or keep doing it. Coming up, we'll share some great sleep research, and we'll find out how reading for just six minutes right before bed can have a profound effect on your sleep. Wow, good job! Are you just you? guessing your decisions from now on here's a trick you think about a decision what yeah you love nodding yes will increase your conviction about your decision and boost your self-confidence instantly well this is i mean this is more of like this is why screens are so powerful in affecting your moods why why uh virtual reality affects your moods your brain can't tell the difference between perceived experiences and actual experiences so if you're nodding your brain is going to think I agree with this, right? And this is also, this reasoning right here is something that you and I both love about doing live performance because you can't second guess the decision. So, uh, you know, nodding is a trick in life that will work for you, but when you're on stage, you're sort of forced to be fully in the moment. Okay. 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 It's the John Tesh Radio Show, Intelligence for Your Life, as per usual. And before you get upset with your partner over something, like not remembering a chore you asked them to do, I want you to ask yourself this question. Are you ready? Because it's going to be great for your relationship and mine, too. Here's a question to think about where you might be with your partner in the future, considering your overall Jesus life you can't take back. See what happens. Grand scheme of your relationship one what? year from next year. <laughs> let it go. This is the John Tesh Radio Show. And coming up, I'll tell you why always rooting for the underdog in a film, in a book, even on the news, will give us an incredible amount of resilience and even success. Yeah.